Hey, Mukon here. I'll be playing Rogue Legacy. Uh, I'm going to be doing the first commentary live. I probably won't be doing that through the whole series, um, just to let you know, because uh, I suck at doing live commentary, but I feel like I need to do it through the first one so that I have enough time to explain everything, because otherwise I won't know how long to stop. Um, anyways, it's a roguelike game. Uh, for those of you who don't know what roguelike is, uh, I, I thought it meant something completely different, but apparently it just means anything that has randomly generated levels in which involves permanent, de permanent death. Uh, so technically Minecraft Survival is a roguelike. Um, anyways, I'm going to have to delete the save because otherwise it'll skip through the beginning part. Um, but I have beaten this game once, um, just so it took me 211 times. Uh, I'm, if it takes me 211 times, I'm not going to have 211 videos, or, or you're not going to get to watch all of them. I will probably do some uh, leveling outside, but I will make sure that I uh, explain everything that I've done and all that fun stuff. But uh, let's just uh, delete and see how it goes. Alright, I should have uh, put out that this is a Metroidvania, which is Castlevania uh, Metroid game. Of course, if you played the first few uh, Metroid games on Nintendo, you'd be confused because none of them play like this. Uh, mainly after Symphony of Night is where they'd come from. Um, this is just a little tutorial level, but I felt like you should see it, just in case. Because, spoiler alert, you will see this again. <laughs> As recording that I do stick with this through the end, and there is no guarantee that I will, because, uh, like you said, it took me 211 tries, and I don't know if I want to do that again. But I'm going to try to, um, but I make no, no guarantees. Ah, uh, yes, I love destroying things in video games. They do nothing, but uh, I just like destroying shit. What can I say? And I am going to try not to swear like I just said shit. Um, and I just said it again. But I'm really trying not to swear. I don't swear a lot as it is, but I do occasionally do that. So, Anyways, on with the game. Ooh, many knights. And the Holy Grail. And demons. And the king. Ooh, wow, you're supposed to attack. You can't jump over him. Hmm. <gasps> Dead king. And that's the tutorial, and here we are back at the beginning. So, the premise is, is that the guy that you just that you just played, um, you're playing his sons and daughters uh, trying to avenge your disgraced name. And here's the training dummy. Can I go back? Ooh, I can. I can't do anything, but I can. Uh, that'll be a play a bigger part later. Uh, I'll explain it in a little bit. Because uh, I will go on with this one a little bit longer than I probably will through the normal ones. Like I said, because I do want to kind of give everybody... You know, not everybody, but just kind of give you what's going on. Journal entry one. Treason. An assassin has wounded my father, the king. To bring order back to my kingdom, he has sent my siblings on a quest to save him. T together, we shall venture into the cursed woods and enter the castle. Castle Hamson. The cursed castle has stood on the edge of the woods since the immemorial time. It doesn't say time there. But rumors say that within the dwells an item that can cure any ailment. Tonight, I will get a head start on my brothers and sisters and set forth my quest and lay while they lay asleep. To fail this quest would be an embarrassment to my name. And let me tell you something, he's going to fail this quest. A lot. Okay, and I don't know if you can see that picture shaking, but that's not really a picture. Oh shit, I am... As you can see, I'm not doing well. I've entered the first... Um, the first little, you know, area here. And I'm already half dead. And um, you can tell pretty much 
swear um, that those pictures are fake because they don't belong. Like, see that one one could belong, but it doesn't. Um, so it is kind of, but generally you just get in the habit of hitting every single one of them. Uh, not that big of a deal. Alright, so I'm going to go in, press here, look at the map. Now this will get annoying, I do apologize. Um, ooh, I can't get to that chest. Um, you need something for that, which will be explained probably in a later video. But yeah, um, ooh, no fighting. I can get through this. Or at least, if you see right there, it says no fighting. There's a chest here that you can only access if you don't. I'll fight, and I died. So yeah, there's that. Okay, so that was my first time. Now I get to choose an heir. Press X, you can see the last guy died. His name is Sir Lee. He's, he had 240 gold. And the stats weren't that impressive. So, here's Sir Lee. There's Joe Nanners, the legendary knight. He was the guy who killed the king in the beginning. Um, so you get to choose an heir. Ooh, let's see here. So I'm not going to explain all this until... Okay. So, the class is a knave. Um, just your basic hero. He's a risky hero. Uh, low starts, but can land devastating critical hits. Uh, he has dwarfism, which I don't know if you can tell. He seems smaller than this than Sir Lee. Um, and he is. Um, and he's a servant. He's very talented. And when we get to the training dummy, I will show you that. He press throws an axe when you press B. So here is your castle. We choose a smith. He unlocks an access to fat loot. Yes, and there's your mana crystal for mana up. And health, and I'm going to buy one of each. Man, I went up by 10. And health went up by 10. And we can upgrade tonight, but we don't have enough gold because I caused 80. It cost 80, and I only have 60. So let's see here. Welcome, hero. Maybe you can help me. I'm the greatest blacksmith in my land, but one day the monster set to the castles and attacked my smithy and stole all my blueprints. Without the blueprints, I can't make cutlery. Bring them back. That's pretty much the gist of it. Okay, so there's a sword, which you can buy if I had 250. I don't. There's a helmet, which you could buy, which if I had 150, which I don't. Um, no. Yeah, so that's pretty much everything. Oh, I see the little exclamation point means that I can't do anything. So he probably does have a cape for sale. Oh, I just need to go here. For the, I didn't think he had a cape for sale. All right. So I'm probably, after I do this... Okay, this guy is Sharon. He's going to steal all my money. Because... He's a dick. Alright, so as you can see... Small... Uh, so right now, I'm pretty much just trying to get as much gold as possible. Uh, ooh. Yeah... That's pretty much what I want. Um, I, there's not a whole lot else I can do. I mean, there, there are four bosses. Um, and I should have stopped at the door. I'll probably play one more after this, uh, just so that I can explain the door, actually. See, this picture is standing still. Because it is a real picture. It is not a demon picture. Man, I was kind of hoping that I'd get more explained, though, in the, out of the way. Okay... I don't like this. Alright, and I don't have a dash ability, so I'm not going to mess with this. And again, I'm making references to things which you have not been introduced with, so that's something I need to work on. Oh, Savant! Damn it. I didn't stop at the training dummy, so I'll, I'll remember next time. Again, I apologize. Alright. So, let's see here. Alright. So, I'm going to be Lady Jenny. Uh, walking tank hero. Has an irritable, irritable, irritable bowel syndrome. Uh, what that means is that occasionally when I jump... 
I will fart. And so, so, yeah, I guess. Yeah, see, farting. Now he's gonna go take all my gold. All right, the door. Okay, so here we go. We have door. You have an eye up in the upper left. A flame in the upper right. A skull in the bottom left, and a little jelly thing. And those are the bosses. I eh, probably should have done that, but eh, it's too late now. You know what the bosses are. Deal with it. And there's my flashlight. Girl, just farting up the place. Okay. Ah, crud. I'm not doing that. Yeah, I'm not doing that one either. Ow. That hurt. Defeat all the enemies. Now, there's probably going to be a wall or something that I can't get through. Yeah. So, if you, if you have certain things, I think the crow is what you need. Uh, you can kill all those, but I can't. So, I don't get the, the uh, goodies in that treasure chest. Boo. Boo. Night bracers. That's spiffy. Ow. And again, I never claimed I was good at this. Um, I am not. Um, but you guys get to watch me suck at video games. Yeah. Oh, okay. So those little things at the bottom, those are spike traps, and I'll walk on one of them. Ooh, yeah, see? Um, yeah, they hurt. Ow, 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 ow. Running away, running away. Okay, and I'm gonna kill this guy. Uh... Oh no. I ran out of mana. <laughs> yeah, sorry, I don't like having things unkilled. Uh, okay. So, I should. Going to do something I shouldn't do. Well, first I'm gonna go see what's in these other rooms real quick. Oh, okay. I don't know if you can tell there's a dark area. You can drop down there and it takes you to a secret area. Pretty keen. Yeah, good times. Good times. And let's see what's going on through here. Mm, there's nothing anywhere. Ooh, no, no, no. Here, I'll, I'll just go in here and try to see. So yeah, well, we're level 19. I'm level 4. That's bad. Okay, that's actually good. I could use that. And I'm going to use my magical teleportation uh, pod, which is that little white thing right here. Go back to here. Go up here. There's a treasure chest. Um, yeah, I'm going to go for it. Okay, so yeah, if those guys weren't above me, I would run like a little girl. Oh shit. Oh, that was dumb. Alright, I'm going to get one more in because I don't think I've been explaining things properly. And I kind of want to give everybody a basic idea so they don't have to explain everything uh, that I'm doing. Okay, this guy, or this girl is also a savant. She's gay. Uh, so there's that. You have that to look forward to. If you're a lady out there. She's also a barbarian. Um, and I noticed that I can't get a knave anymore because of the knight upgrade. Oh no, I can. I haven't got that upgrade yet. Huh. Okay, so I have 800. Um, so I'm going to do that. And as you can see, the castle gets a little bit bigger. Uh, I'm going to unlock the enchantress. Um, she gives you magic spells, which is awesome. Magic up. And upgrade to mage. And I really want to buy um, other stuff, but like I kind of want to get the architect because if I would have got the architect, architect, I could have went to the boss. Then I'm an idiot. All right, there's the new bracers. As you can see, they're better than the squire ones. Go here, and pretty much she, there's runes, and she wants me to buy for them. 
And there's double jump, and there's dash, and I need both of those because I can't function without them. Okay, and then, oh, 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 let me go back. So, there's training dummy. You can test things out. It hurts. So as you see, he's a savant, which means he masters things. But if you look, I threw size, and now I'm going to throw a dagger, a dagger, and the knife thing, which I don't like. So pretty much it just cycles through every time you... And that's what the savant does. Uh, I do want to explain what all the traits do. Um, let you experience them all, even though some of them I hate with a passion. So this is probably going to be a lot longer video than I wanted it to. Um, here's left of the mask of the castle. Pretty much you can see that their main castle is in the middle. Uh, if you go to the right, or go to east, there's the forest. You go north, they're up to the top. There's the tower, and you go down or south, and there's the dungeon. Oh, yeah. And, and as you can see, they have uh, special layouts. Like, this one's going to be full of just pointy shit. And again, pardon my language, I'm really trying not to... Ah! Not swear as much. Uh, ooh, I like the chakra. But in this case, you do get to look, uh, see all of the different kind of uh, special weapons that they have, because I... Well, I actually don't use my special weapons very often. I think it's magic, actually, but I don't care. Yeah, and you can also tell, if you wait a while, that they will shake the pictures. But sometimes they'll wait a little bit longer than I need like to. And there's nothing in here, um, so I have no no reason to be in here. But I'm not very smart, so I'm going in here. Ooh. Ooh. Bastard. Alright, Rex and Furniture. Rex and some Furniture. Alright. And again, I know this is probably bad, because it's a lot of silence, and silence is bad. Alright. So this is a challenge. I sh think I should be able to do this. I can't guarantee it. Nope. Yeah, went without my special abilities. Ew. <laughs> no. All right. So hopefully that's been first video. Hopefully you'll learned a bit about the game. 